Well, the athletes aren't the only ones training hard for the Olympics. Police sniffer dogs have been busy nosing for explosives and drugs at venues. Wolverhampton Wanderers have let the dogs in so they can get a feel for a real stadium before the games begin. Callum Watkinson reports. Months of training, single-minded dedication and a committed coach. Only the best are chosen for this explosive sniffer dog team. They'll be in action at the city of Coventry Stadium during the Olympics. As athletes train for their big fortnight, the dogs have been practicing at the Molyneux Stadium. We try and recreate our work in as much as live environments as possible, thus enhancing the dog's work, the handler's work and making everything sure uh, that we're fully prepared for any eventuality. If we use venues that are not real, then it's not to me real training. What I like to do is provide that reality. Stamina and energy make Spaniels perfect for the job and Wolves are more than happy to help the dogs hit top form. It was just an opportunity for us to extend an already really good relationship that we have with the police and give them the opportunity to work in an environment that they will be working in in the Olympics. As a professional football club, it's wonderful for us to have, have had that opportunity to assist the police in, in making people feel safer around the Olympic stadiums. Just like athletes, sniffer dogs sometimes suffer from injury. Bodhi here is just back from an operation and now has a piece of fishing wire in place of one of his cruciate ligaments. But as you can see, he's now fighting fit and ready to play his role in the Olympics. Bodhi, go find. 12 Olympic football matches will be played at the city of Coventry Stadium starting on July the 25th. It looks as though footballers and fans are in safe pause.